Root Vivo S17e without PC or laptop. If you are looking forward to know how to root Vivo S17e without PC or laptop, then you have come to the right place. Routing your device will basically give you elevated permissions. After routing Vivo S17e, you will be able to change or replace system apps and settings. And you will be able to run specialized apps that require administrator level permissions. After routing, other operations that are otherwise inaccessible to a normal Android user can be performed with ease. Besides that, you will also get access to some not so great hidden device features. Vivo S17e root content. What is routing? Phone specifications. Things to do before routing. Top 4 apps for root. Pros and cons of routing. How to check if it is rooted or not. How liberated. What is routing? Routing basically means allowing users of smartphones, tablets, and other devices running the Android mobile operating system to gain privileged control. Otherwise known as root access. At its simplest, routing, is the process by which the commands and administrative functions of the operating system are accessed. In simple terms, it gives you permission to act as a phone administrator, similar to programs running as administrators in Windows. Vivo S17e specifications in a nutshell. Vivo S17e features a 6.78-inch FHD Plus display mounted on an AMOLED panel. The screen offers a resolution of 1080 by 2400 pixels that offers an aspect ratio of 20 to 9 and a pixel density of 388 pixels per inch. Under the hood, the device is equipped with MediaTek Dimensh T7200 SOC chipset coupled with an octa-core processor, Mali G610MC4 GPU, and up to 12 GB of RAM. The phone packs up to 256 GB of internal storage which cannot be expanded further. Vivo S17e is equipped with a dual camera module on the back, a 64 megapixels, wide, primary camera, and a 2 megapixels depth sensor camera, while it provides a 16 megapixel front camera. Vivo S17e boots on Origin OS 3 based on Android 13. It is well backed by a 4,600 mAh battery that supports 66W fast charging. Things to do before routing Vivo S17e. Please follow the list of instructions and things to do before you start to route the device. Perform a full backup of your Vivo S17e. Vivo S17e should be running. Your device's bootloader must be unlocked. Vivo S17e must be charged to at least 70%. Enable or allow installation of applications from unknown sources. Internet connection required. Wi-Fi recommended. Rooted Vivo S17e. 4 best apps to root Vivo S17e without PC. Kingroot. Frama Root. iRoot. Fruit. Kingroot. Download Kingroot APK. Install Kingroot APK on Vivo S17e. Click on the Start button. You can see a pop-up message that it will start routing soon. You will see a success message once completed. Now enjoy your newly rooted device. Frama Root. Download and install Frama Root APK on Vivo S17e. Select Exploit from the list appropriate for your device and click on Root. If you are not sure if the exploit is compatible with your device, check one by one. A successful message will appear. It is compatible with your device. Vivo S17e will start routing. Now select Super SU to install it. 
It will install an app in your Android phone called Super SU which manages all Super missions of different root apps. Congratulations! Your Android phone has been successfully rooted. iRoot. Download the iRoot APK on your Vivo S17e. Install it on your smartphone. Click on the root option. It will start to root your smartphone. That's it. Your phone is rooted. VRoot. Download VRoot APK on your Vivo S17e. Install the APK file. Click on the start button to start the routing process. After completing the routing process, you need to restart the device. It installs some apps on your phone. You can always continue to use them. Or you can uninstall them at any time if you do not want to use their help. Pros and cons of routing Vivo S17e. Advantages. You can increase the internal memory of the device. You can overclock and underclock your CPU and GPU. You can install those apps which require the phone to be rooted. You can change themes and their settings as you wish. By changing the color of the battery indicator, boot icon, and much more. Cons. It will void your warranty. The device may get bricked if anything goes wrong during the routing process. If something goes wrong, you can lose all your precious data and other important files. Your system operating system cannot be upgraded to newer versions of via OTA. How to check if Vivo S17e is rooted or not. You can always check if you are not sure about the routing process being done properly or not. On your Vivo S17e smartphone, you can use the Root Checker app to check and confirm. Follow the process mentioned. Download the Root Checker app. Install it on your device. Open the app. If it asks for permission, give the super user permission. If not, then there is no problem you can proceed to the next step. If your phone is properly rooted, you will get a success message. If it is not properly rooted, you can move on to other routing options. How to unroot Vivo S17e easily. If you do not want your Vivo S17e to be rooted and want to bring it back to normal, you can always do that. You can root your Vivo S17e smartphone with the help of the Super SU app. Download the Super SU app on your Vivo S17e smartphone. Install the Super SU app. Open the app. Click on Settings. Scroll down and tap on the full unroot option. Now tap continue to proceed with the unroot process. Your phone will begin to unroot. After unrooting, your Vivo S17e will automatically reboot and uninstall all unwanted apps with Super SU.